Hey guys, so today I'm going to film my what's in my bag. I haven't done one of these videos since I first started, so I figured it'd be something fun to do. And I guess, you know, I always love watching these videos, so I figured, why not? Let's do an updated one. So, let's jump right in. The bag that I have is the uh, Hamilton by Michael Kors. And the color... I believe this bag is seasonal because I know, this is a gift actually, my boyfriend got it for me, but I believe it's like Mystic Grey or, oh, Pearl Grey, Pearl Grey, Pearl Grey, sorry. So um, this is what it looks like. It's really big, but I am a big purse um, fanatic, so all my purses have to be big. I put like everything in them. Um, it has the little key in here. For those of you that don't know, which is kind of cool. So this is the little key. You can see it. And that just unlocks the lock, but I don't ever do um, that. So we'll jump right in. I'm going to go at random. It looks pretty messy in here. So if, you know, this is going to be kind of like cleaning out my bag at the same time. So let's see. I'm just going to start pulling stuff out of the sides, I guess. Okay. I'll show you the inside at the end, too. But... In one of my little pockets in here, I have this Sephora little, scoot up, this little Sephora eyeshadow kit, and I think it has lips in it too, and it comes with a little brush. So this is just kind of my touch-up eyeshadow if I ever need it. I haven't really used it too much. It's mainly like a mirror, I think. That's what I usually use it for. And then underneath, this slides out, so it's like lip glosses or like lip yeah lip glosses and then the um blush which I have not used but there's that and then I have these which are really old uh little things but they're Andrea Fresh Up so they're basically oil blotting sheets and I think my mom gave these to me but I've had them in here forever. And they have a ton of them. I'm almost running out, it looks like. But they just blot the oil off your face because I'm an oily skinned okay. woman. I have a little knuckle ring right here that I didn't find. So I'm just going to put that on. That's it. That was in there. Um, lots of trash. I found a cough drop. Again, this is going to be really messy. Let's see. Some receipts. Okay. Next pocket, I have more paper. Looks like lots of receipts and my grocery list. Yep. From probably like a month ago. And then. Oh, Chick fil A free breakfast. Uh, August 17th through the 21st, be sure to go in and get your free breakfast, okay? These are all the items on there. They came into my work and gave it to us because we're right by a Chick-fil-A. And my baby Versace um, perfume. David, my boyfriend, if you guys don't know, he got me the whole um, Euros Versace like perfume set. So this is my baby one that I keep in my purse and then I have the big one that I keep here at the house. So there's that. Okay. Um, I have my phone and it's just the iPhone 6 uh, in rose gold or gold. This is basically it's just me and David. And then the case is just like a rose gold bumper kind of thing. And then it's clear plastic on the back. And then that's really it. And then I have my keys. So I have my car key here. And then I have this little kind of weird looking angel thing that my mom gave me. She wanted me to put it on my keys my house key, my parents' house key, my dad's house key, 
and then David's spare car key which no I'm not the crazy girlfriend that made him give it to me he wanted me to have it in case I ever needed or like he locked himself out I or something he wanted opener. me to keep it on here and then my styles for less which I never use but it's a styles for less little card thing like points thingy my bobber down the ground my sunglasses, which should be in my car, these are, they have like a case and stuff I usually keep in my car, but sometimes I have them on while I get out. So this is them. They're not really all that fancy. They're guests. So I've had these forever and they're the only glasses that fit comfortably like on my face, I guess. And it looks like I have, so this I just got actually last night and I threw it in my bag. Um, I was at Sephora doing some shopping and I had points so they were like pick something and I told her to surprise me so she got this Elizabeth and James Nirvana for her it's like a little perfume which honestly it really does smell good I think it's like a very feminine smell it's nice oh and then I have this which I got at Macy's a while ago I'm really weird. I like to keep things in the box. I probably have two of them in here, actually, because I mix them. But these are the Anastasia Beverly Hills lipstick, liquid lipsticks. So I got them at Macy's because I guess they're, like, in contract with Macy's. So they don't have them at Sephora. They don't have them um, at Ulta. So these are just the lipsticks, and I got the color... Veronica and Sepia and I've been wearing them a lot lately so I've been mixing them so I keep them in my bag. So that's Veronica and then I have Sepia which is like this really deep brown which I love but I do kind of like an ombre looking thing with it so I keep them but that's that one. There. So that's those and then I have a coin purse Louis Vuitton. I got this for my mom. Actually, I stole it from my mom. I'm pretty sure. She has, she's like one of those, she's like the woman in The Devil Wears Prada. So she just has tons of stuff and like, she doesn't need it. So I've had this one forever. And it's just a little coin purse that I have not taken out. I take this thing everywhere. But, and it has like a little pocket in the back here and that's like a gift card. And then it has the little fluffy flaps. <laughs> and okay. Then deodorant, because your girl always needs to um, freshen up throughout the day. You know what I'm saying. <laughs> and I have my favorite gum in here, which is the Trident Cinnamon. I'm chewing it right now, actually. It's so good. I don't know. I, my coworker had this. And I like ate his entire pack of gum. So I had to replace it. So I went and bought like 20 of them. And I seriously love this. And David really likes it too. So it comes in handy when, since I'm the one that carries everything in here. And then we have my favorite, my all time favorite chapstick or lip balm, whatever you want to call it. This is a lip balm. So it's Smith's Minted Rose. And they just, I got this at Charming Charlie's, if you guys have one near you. I'm pretty sure they sell them other places, but they're usually seven bucks. But, um, and they're not colored like this, but it makes your lips tingle and it's like minty rose. So it's really nice and like creamy all throughout the day. But I also got the strawberry one, just the rosebud. And then I got another one of these because they went from seven bucks to $1.99. So, um. I went and got those, but those are, that's my favorite, they last forever. And before I get to the other pockets, I will finish up, so this is my wallet, this is also Michael Kors, same color, so they go together. I got this actually more recently, so not, I didn't get it at the same time as my bag, um, but you open it up, and let me see if anything is, I'll just... Basically, my picture is really weird, but so it has all these pockets and whatnot is really nice. And then all these pockets here and then more pockets. There's like two more there, 
one under there. So it's really big. You can fit the iPhone 6 in it. I'm pretty sure you can fit the iPhone 6 Plus too. So you can actually put that in the little pocket there. And you can put everything. And then you can use it as a clutch. You can take this off if you want to, but this is what actually helps me find it sometimes when I have all the stuff in there. You just grab it and it comes out. So love it, love it. And then, yeah, that's my wallet. Oh, and it has like little coins in here too. I have lots of coins in my bag. So that's that. But, and then, okay, and now I have like tons of stuff in here that I guess I have to show you. So it's just <laughs> tons of lip glosses and stuff that I've never taken out. So I have the CoverGirl. I don't know what these are. These are old, but I still use them. It's like the CoverGirl lip glosses. I don't know if they have a specific name. I got them at Target, though. And this is like more of a nude color, so it gives you that like slight pink nude. So I really like that one. And then this is totally nude. This makes my lips like crazy nude. Um, this is Too Faced Melted Liquid Longwear Lipstick. So it's in the color Melted Sugar. So I love this one. I actually forgot I had that. forgot I had that. Um, this, I don't know why this is in here because I have not used these in years and I've not had this bag for years. I must have just thrown it in there. This is a uh, Hello Kitty, actually you know what, this is probably for my little sister and I meant to give it to her. It's Hello Kitty, but they're from Sephora, so like Sephora back in the day like had this, I don't know if they still do, um, had the like little Hello Kitty eyeliners and all that stuff, like in a little like gift set thing. So this is like a navy eyeliner, it's kimono, that's the color, but it's just like a navy colored liner. And then, I'll take a couple out at a time. This is my NYX Butter Gloss. I love NYX Butter Gloss. I had like five of them at one time, and then through the move and everything like that, I probably lost them. But this one was one of my favorites. I think it's Strudel, Apple Strudel, Strudel, maybe. It's all jacked up at the bottom, but... That's that one right there. And then I have this Paula Dwarf, which came in a whole lip gloss set, but my mom is also, she works in makeup. She's a makeup artist, so she gets all like this makeup stuff, and I always get to pick and choose from them. So that's Paula Dwarf. I thought this was going to be a really pigmented, like bright, rosy red. It's not. It's like pink when it goes on, but it's it's nice it's just really sticky it's like like you feel like you can feel it like like coming I don't know off <laughs> and then I have a plum prospect from these are whisper color whisper I think they're by Maybelline yeah so it's color whisper by Maybelline and this is again a plum prospect and this, I like the darker colors for fall, so it's kind of, comes out like that. And when it goes on, it is like a lip gloss, so it's like, it has this color in it. And it does come out pretty pigmented, like on your lips and everything. But it's more glossy, so it has a shinier effect going on, which I enjoy. I'm kind of in between. I like both, actually, lately. Okay. So, um, for those of you that don't know, in fact, actually... This has been recent since Olaf just came out. I'm obsessed with Olaf. I have stuffed animals, blankets, I have like a beanie, um, pretty sure I have socks, I have everything. So I also have a pen that I keep in my bag and it's just a little Olaf pen. Because I love him, he's so cute. And then I have Clinique's Super Balm Moisturizing Gloss, which I absolutely love. And this I actually got from my mom. She works for Clinique. Um, but this stuff is awesome. Like it gives you like a 
more natural like pinky tint to your lips but then it's also super moisturizing and lasts forever and it's like soft and smooth and just wonderful let's say just wonderful and then I have a NYX butter lipstick and this is in sugar wafer so it is like another nude I was really into nudes at one time so I had like a billion of them, but this is it. It literally looks just like the tube. And then I have Vincent Long. I have hair everywhere. I shed like an animal. Um, flourish, flourish. And this is Vincent Longo's lipstick. It's like a nude pink kind of when you put it on. So I have that gray. This is a wine glass marker, and no, I don't drink, but um, my aunt, it was like, we are at like one of our family parties or something, and I was like, this is so cute. I love turquoise and teal, if you guys can't tell, my whole apartment is gray, teal, and black and white, so... Um, but it's turquoise and she was like, oh, I'll take it. So I have had that in there since then. And grab all this other stuff. I have hair bands in here. So I have this, which is just an outlet full of my phone charger. Hair. Hair band. Uh, Cocoa butter chapstick, which this was David's, and I fell in love with it and took it, and I need to throw it away now because I think it is melted. It's melted because he left it in his car, or I didn't. Must have thrown it in here. Yes, and then I have some Dayquil. It's just Dayquil. That was because I was, for the longest time, like constantly had a cold, like the worst cold ever. It was actually David and I and cannot get over it. Oh, I have more. So this is one of those body butter and lavender from Dior 24 karat. You know at the mall they like randomly come out and like ah, scare you and then make you take one of these. So I have the, that. And then I have, this is by Clinique and this is Creamy Nude. This is one of my absolute favorite nude lipsticks and this is uh, I wear this all the time, so I always have keep that in there. And it looks like I have a Kiss Mix by Pop, which is Golden Kiss Lip Palette. So it looks like this. And then when you open it, oh crap, it looks like that. So it seems weird, like the colors in there, but it's actually, I like the colors, believe it or not. I. Because they're not really that orange when you put it on. So I have that. And then I have another one of these CoverGirl lip glosses. And this is in like a rosy natural pink. So it actually happens to be like the same color of my nips. My nips? Oh gosh. My lips naturally. So I like that guy. And now I think I basically emptied out. I just have my pepper spray clipped back in there. So this is the inside of my bag. It has a little magnetic button that you can like snap there. It also has this, which is you can attach your keys to it. If you're someone like me who cannot ever find their keys when they need to in their bag. So that, and then it has two pockets on this side right here and here. And then on the other side, you guys can see it has two pouch pockets there, and then it has a zipper, which is where I keep all my makeup and stuff, and there's just more wrappers. But that is basically it for my what's in my bag. If you have any questions about where to get this bag or products in my bag, please comment below, and I would be so happy to film another video for you. I will be having lots of tutorials coming up. I have filmed a few recently, but my computer unfortunately was having some issues, so I'm going to need to use David's computer or something or get a new one. 
so uh, that can all be solved. But I will have more videos coming up for you, I promise, um, in the next few weeks. So other than that, I hope you guys have a great day, morning, evening, whatever time it is, wherever you are.